Snoopy. Good to miss you. We got to miss you. Take still. Okay. Hey, welcome back, everyone. So this is again going to be another travel vlog. So what you are looking at is that um, I have uh, packed uh, uh, food for my pets. So I'm going to board them to our neighbor house. So they are they live in the same building. So here they are. So we are boarding them together, and we are getting back home. <laughs> So I'll show you what have I packed. These are just going to be uh, snacks and quick bites. So I've just packed some brownies and some uh, drinks. And um, as usual, I wherever I go, I carry some dark chocolates and some energy bars and some chips. That's all. So as you know, like you know, as the titles say. We are going to travel to Tobamari from Toronto and I am so excited. So good morning guys. It's um, 4 a.m. in the morning and we have packed and we are going to uh, start from Toronto to Tobamari. I know it is pretty much early say because we have booked our first cruise around say 8.50 a.m and so we are starting early and so we are here at the gas station this is our first stop so we are just going to quickly use the washroom and checking out to grab something if we really want to the best part is we have Tim Hortons here we can grab some coffee I'm just waiting for my partner if he really wants to grab some because he is going to drive and we just grab some coffee and we are heading to Tobamori. and i know i don't know why i'm just repeating this all the time anyways so as you see it's getting lighter and i'm capturing the beautiful sunrise this is the best thing of the travel So we are almost there, we are heading to our parking and now we are heading to uh, parking A lot so there's other one parking B so now we are in the parking A and the parking is not full yet because we are early. So now uh, we are just walking towards harbor and uh, yeah I just spotted that fish and chips restaurant like I did see in a lot of YouTube videos yeah I just got a little bit excited about that anyways now we are heading to a restaurant because almost like all the restaurant will open around say 8 a.m. we are here before 8 a.m. so like we don't see any of them opened so there was just one restaurant opened and serving coffee and breakfast so we we are just thinking of quickly grabbing them and have it here and then like you know boarding the cruise We have grabbed a coffee and heading to our car so we thought okay we'll just sit and just uh, have our breakfast because the restaurant didn't allow people inside and we didn't have anywhere to sit and have our breakfast so we thought okay we'll just come to the car and have breakfast so before that guys always like get a boarding pass and then like you know you take your time to just explore the places so we uh, before getting back to the car we made sure that we get our boarding passes for the cruise so you don't have to rush yourself to the cruise 
so the cruise is to the left side of the harbor so we are walking towards it and now we see people there's already a queue waiting to board so we had enough time we were just uh, waiting in the queue for say like say 15 to 20 minutes and uh, while waiting there we were just looking around the harbor we saw a lot of models so if you're planning here you could have an option um, of uh, driving the previous night and stay in the motels and then like you know in the next day you have your first cruise so as you see we are finally boarding so we are the first batch to head to Tobomori, the flower pot island so usually there there are a lot of cruise which goes to the other places also you can find it on the website So our cruise has started, so we are going to just enjoy the scenery. We finally reached and so we are just getting out from the cruise as you see people are very much busy to use the washrooms and we are the first set of people so there are really not much people in the island and we just headed to this uh, information place and we're just checking out to start with so we picked up the mountain trail as we saw a lot of people were heading to the flower pot and we were more inclined towards to do some trail walks and then get back to the flower pot island it's kind of a loop so we are going to start by this way Hey guys as you see now we are on the other end of the island we just completed the mountain trail and the mar bed trail so we are now super tired and uh, yeah a uh, mountain trail was a bit challenging because it had a lot of uphill and downhill but you can just still give it a try so guys i have reached uh, the main spot that is the flower pot island so there is two flower pot they call it as one as small and the other one is as large and so I see people around taking pictures and I can see crews dropping off people and picking up people and this place is amazing so 
I am at the tip of Bruce Peninsula. Maybe you can check it in the Google. So I did click few pictures near the flower pot island. If you would like to check it, you can now head to my um, Instagram page and you can check it out. I will leave the link in the description box. So it was calm and quiet and very pleasant as we came here in the first cruise. So as you see, it is the small flower pot. So as of now, this place is not crowded. Um, but I think it's going to be very busy as the cruise is coming in. So we didn't feel like leaving this place so gently. Uh, you will have three hours to spend in the island. So our cruise to the harbor is around say 12.30 so people are already here to board so it's always better to be on time. So maybe if you miss your time maybe I think they will push you to the next uh, batch I'm not sure but yeah they did check the ticket if you are boarding at the right cruise. So all set, we are boarded and we are getting back to the harbor. Yeah, we had really good time in this flower pot island and it's must visit guys. So hope you enjoyed my travel vlog to Tobamori and more to come. Thank you.